Hey everyone, Brittany Carmichael here, bringing you your live weekly Woo Woo Wednesday Tarot reading, where I tune into the energy of what's going on and help guide you through whatever energy is going on in your life. And the way that this reading works for all of us is that you pay attention to the thoughts and the feelings and the visions that you receive during this reading. Um, today I'll be working with the Crystal Unicorn Tarot deck from my girlfriend Pamela Chin over at Luna Process. Prosperity. She just created this beautiful unicorn tarot and if you guys know me, you know I love tarot and you know I love unicorns and I love crystals. So it's all my favorite things in one little box here. So I'm excited to join you with the crystal unicorn tarot from Pamela Chin of Luna Prosperity and I decided to pull out the Keepers of the Light Oracle deck from Kyle Gray. I just feel like there's some divine light working wisdom that needs to come through today. So I feel like we should pull one Oracle card from the Keepers of the Light and we'll do our traditional three card reading for the week. Say hello if you're here. Hey, Krista. Hey, Vala. Hey, Claire. Heather, Melissa. Oh my gosh, Jamie, it's so good to see you all. Say hello if you're joining and where are you joining from? Um, yay, I love that deck. Yeah, me too. I'm excited. I really haven't um, used it too much, so I'm excited to get my energy infused in it and turn it into my own special favorite deck. So today will be a great day to tune in. Um, so what's going on in your world right now? How's your new year? off to how's the start like how's this year going for you are you like okay on a scale of one to ten you guys if you've ever heard me talk about my favorite game that I play with you know uh, helping me to decide well a card already fell out helping me to decide what it is that I want in life I rate everything on a scale of one to ten ten is amazing and one is sucky so on a scale of one to ten how's your new year how's this 2018 energy working for you are you taking the action oriented momentum that we're that's building up at the beginning of the year and uh, accomplishing your dream man these cards are already flying out I guess I guess they're ready <laughs> they are ready for me to get going I mean wow I just barely even touch them and the cards are flying out Oh, I love this card. Um, okay, seven, ten, eight. Holy smokes, you guys are doing awesome. So much growth. Seven, move on up. Ten, hi from Sweden. Oh my gosh, you guys are amazing. So what is it that you're, what's your theme for this year? Like, what are you going after? For me, this year, I've been doing a lot of free master classes. If you caught my free uh, Manifest Your Dreams master class last week, I'm having so much fun teaching. Um, I just got off an interview about how going plant-based helped my psychic abilities enhance. That was a really fun one. And Chris and I are actually putting together a free class for you guys on how to balance your relationships. You know, I'm teaching you guys self-discovery and going inward and, and reclaiming your power and how to live your life. And, and it's all about you, right? So now I want to teach you how once you've gone in and you've dealt with your fears and your problems and you're finding out who you are, now you have to come back out into the world and play with other people. So I want to teach you guys how to integrate your own energy and be whole and accepting of yourself and then come out into the world and be able to share that same love and compassion and not be moved by other people's opinions or judgments. Um, I was a nine yesterday. Today is an eight fighting a fever. If you're an eight and have a fever, you're crushing it. <laughs> Um, eight, so much is unfolding, I'm riding the wave, seven, I love this guys, wow, that was the reason um, Archangel Raphael helped to push me to go vegetarian and now progressing to vegan. Oh, wow, what a great, um, what a great thing for, two cards came out, we're just gonna go with it guys, <laughs> these cards have their own agenda today. Um, I love that, the conversation that I just had, the interview about going plant-based was somewhat controversial, which was quite interesting because I feel like all of us who are waking up are are moving towards a more plant-based diet. So is that you? Let me know in the comments. Like, yes, I'm transitioning to a plant-based diet. Let me know in the comments. I'm manifesting the life I've been visualizing for years using the momentum I've built. Yeah, keep going. Reclaiming my power. Um, five, I keep getting sick and feeling kind of stuck in a rut, but I'm seeing the magic of the 11 year all over. Well, Jennifer, then that is proof to you that your thoughts are creating your reality, especially in a year 11. They're even doubly powerful. So if you're saying, I feel sick and in a rut, then your story, your statement, your emotional energy behind it is what's contributing to that reality that you're experiencing so you can shift it immediately by saying 
I'm out of this rut and whatever energy or emotion you want to feel, claim it now and you'll begin to start feeling that way. Um, Heather, yes, transitioning, love that. Um, yes, I'm vegan, Aaron says. Um, looks that my hopes to go vegetarian. Hello, my daughter is moving out in February with her boyfriend. Um, will she be happy? Well, if she's moving out, she's obviously, it, committed enough to make that jump and that transition so will she be happy is up to her because happiness is a choice um, and she's choosing to leave her home base and start a new family or a new partnership so it sounds like she's headed in the right direction um, you're right thank you love awesome helping humans connect with the earth and each other using my skills and talents I love that that's really why we're here right so let's dive in thanks for sharing I'm vegan here sweet thanks for sharing where you're at along your journey um, another thing I'm super excited to bring you guys um, it's almost February, so next month in February, I am launching my Tarot course, and it will be live, just like this, because I realized I was filming all the videos, and I was covering all the content, and I was kind of bored because I had no one on the other side to receive that information in the moment. So what I've decided is to put that project aside and to join you live and to teach you live so that I can help you to discover what questions and blocks that you have right now. I was tired of talking to a blank screen. I want to talk to people who really want to learn and integrate this. So I want you to shoot me a private message or leave a comment below if you're interested in joining my live masterclass where I'm going to teach you all my secrets of Tarot, whether you're a Tarot beginner and it's a 101 or you're a seasoned pro and just need a new perspective or maybe a new way to look at the cards um, it, this course will be for you it will be a live workshop so you have me one-on-one -on -one, and guys I'm only gonna launch it for $97 so this is going to be a steal I'm gonna teach you how to use Tarot for yourself so let me know if that's something you're interested in the um, the course is coming together I'm so freaking excited and it will be launching live in February um, my birthday is on the 5th. Perfect birthday gift, Claire says. How exciting. You're an Aquarius. My husband is on the 7th, so I know you're kind very well. Krista says, yes, I can't wait. We will get a chance to have guided practice readings during the master class. Um, yes, you will. We have guided practice readings during the master class. I like that. Why not? <laughs> we, this is why I want to do it live, because I want to give you what you need.